Today I will start the uh, dismantling process uh, for the glass urn by placing it into a, a closed and sealed box environment uh, with a jar of acetone. And for this, uh, my colleagues uh, Sarai and Michael will be helping me because uh, the object is quite large and awkward. So we're going to do the uh, kind of placement of the object into the box together. You can see I also filled inside the urn with lots of um, support materials, some acid-free tissues and bubble wrap so that during the dismantling process, um, when acetone starts um, softening the adhesive and when the fragments start coming uh, apart, um, they will not actually fall onto each other and uh, create damage. I am also now placing the acetone in a jar um, into our environment. And finally, I am putting these um, plastic sheets onto the box uh, to actually give it a more seal to the environment. So during the next two days, I'll be checking the object to see if acetone is working and softening the um, old adhesive and actually the dismantling process is happening. It could be, you know, tomorrow or it could be the day after or it could be in a week time so it all depends on how strongly the old ATC is actually holding the joints together uh, but fingers crossed uh, everything's gonna go well and uh, within a few days you know we should be able to dismantle the object. Mm -hmm.